my name is Paige. Ever since I can remember, I love space and rockets, and these are my adventures. Last time I was given a rocket, but disaster struck and a fin broke. Our mission was to repair the fins, replace the paint job, and fly it. To do this, we acquired an SD's Big Daddy to understand how to put it together. It consists of a nose cone, body tube, three part motor mount, and a four bolster wood fins. Finally, a short cord and parachute for safe landings. The fins have a T-shaped tab which slots perfectly into the motor mount, locking it to the body. Our fins will replicate this, but with way more style.
The rocket has been called the big mistake. The idea is to make a really cool looking lightweight fins, but they turned out slightly heavier than I hoped. This is a problem. Ideally, for rockets to fly straight, the center of pressure has to be significantly behind the center of gravity. And there are two tricks to making that better. Either make the air of the back bigger, i.e. bigger fins, or make the front heavier. Both are bad. Bigger fins means more drag and slower flight. More weight also means slower flight. Talking to the members of the ears, the center of gravity needs to be more than one body width forward of the center of pressure or better. After adding sand, the center of gravity was moved forward about two body widths the center of pressure. But this made it almost twice the weight of a factory big daddy. In summary, the Big Daddy pulled into the wind significantly. This is textbook weather cocking. The strong wind on the fins pushes the bottom more than the top, turning the rocket into the wind. Dad's m big mistake flew better in the wind than the Big Daddy, but being heavier did not reach the same heights. Finally, can I say thank you to everyone at the East Anglian Rocketry Society both the RSO and the other volunteers who make it possible, as well as all the members who offer advice, help and encouragement. And of course, you. And if you did like it, please click like and subscribe. <laughs>